Hello ladies and gentlemen, Beaky here with another how-to. Let's show you guys three different ways you can go ahead and show yourself offline on the PlayStation 4. First thing first, from the main menu of the login screen, go ahead and press your button on your controller, then go ahead and press the option menu. You'll be able to get these two new settings on the 3.5 update to either log in or pair offline. Go ahead and click it right there, then go ahead and log in, and once you go up to your little profile icon, you will now appear offline to your friends, and it will show yourself right there it says big beaky and if you go down it'll say appearing offline so now on your friend list your friends will not know that you're online there are a few different ways that you will still show up online and I'm gonna show you guys this in a moment the other way to show yourself to be online or offline is click on profile go to online status and then go ahead and click online or offline whichever one you do press make sure you guys know it's gonna take a few seconds to register once it registers, you can press it back let's say that you go ahead and load up a game let's say you're in the middle of track mania per se once you're inside the game let's just go ahead and load in the game you don't always want to have to go all the way back to the the log out screen or to your profile screen so what you actually can do is go ahead and hold down the PSN button on your controller once you hold that down for a few seconds it'll go ahead and bring up your options menu once you're there you go to online status and once again you go pair offline so if you're a youtuber anybody that constantly gets a lot of messages or you just want to enjoy your game enjoy your track mania this is an easy way for you to go ahead and do that now there are some caveats to know with this offline functionality on the new PlayStation 4 3.5 update if you do log in on the PlayStation 3 or somebody else in your family are using your PlayStation 3 to watch Netflix or you're using a Vita, it will show you online on those systems. So it will still look like you're online playing games or watching movies on those platforms. So do know it's not a universal offline for all your PlayStation connected devices. So there you go, guys. That's been a quick little video showing you guys how to appear offline on the PlayStation 4. More tips and tricks in the playlist in the description. And if you guys haven't seen the process video of how to update to this new update video or want to know how to actually do remote play from your PlayStation 4 to the PC, make sure you guys go into the description of the video and click the links down below for those videos. Till next time, peace out.